The ABCs of Garla. A is for active learners. We take Eric Jensen seriously. Peddlers, treadmills, active brain breaks, energizers, jam a minute, and hiking outside to explore provide opportunities for brain growth and development to keep our students alert and engaged. B is for best practice. Our staff can't be beat with the best and most current educational practice. Our staff is all around amazing and many have received an impressive, impressive array of awards including Minnesota Teacher of the Year finalist and nominee, WEM Outstanding Educator, Presidential Awardee for the Teacher of Science, Minnesota Science Teacher of the Year, Maitland B. Simmons, New Science Teacher of the Year, University of Minnesota William E. Gardner, Outstanding Educator, Teacher to the Max, Ties Technology of the Year, Jeffers Grant, Office Max, Outstanding Educator, Mom on a Mission, Walmart Teachers of the Year, Egan Sam's Club and WSP Walmart, and Minnesota Math and Science Principal of the Year. C is for the class, class, classroom critters that motivate learning. We have over 50 pet animals in our school, not counting the Madagascar hissing cockroaches. Students observe, record data, write, and study them to learn function, structure, life cycles, behaviors, and even engineering concepts as aligned with Minnesota State academic standards. D is for Dutch, our amazing partner across the street. Many families have told us that they enrolled their children at Garlow because of this unique and successful partnership. Our students have unlimited access to Dodge Nature Center, where learning is enhanced tenfold through exploration of nature. E is for engaged in reading discussions. Garlo kids are active readers working with highly skilled classroom Title I on ELL staff. This is for fast forward. Our struggling readers participate in this intense, individually designed reading program, making up to 1.5 years of growth in three months. G is for Gobs of Gardens. We have many rain garden, community garden, raised garden beds, butterfly garden, to name a few. Gardens make up many of our owls, and each station has standards-based lessons attached to engage our learners. G is also for Global Citizens, which is what students graduating from Garlow have become. H is for hissing cockroaches, the kind from Madagascar. These gentle giants of the insect world are every in every classroom and are dearly loved by the children. Because of their large size and their lethargic behavior, they are very excellent live specimens for study. It's for eye nature. A specialist class that unites our magnet theme with Minnesota State standards and brings a diverse global perspective to the environment. It is for Jeffers Foundation. Another fantastic partner to Garlow, supporting us in all of our environmental education endeavors. K is for kindness. Garlo is a kindness project school. K is for language. Almost half of our students are challenged with learning a new language every day. M is for magnet because we attract a large variety of learners who care about our world. N is for nurturing nature. That's what we do. <laughs> o 
Tales for Owls are 20 outdoor wonder learning stations. P is for phonology. We notice the seasonal changes in nature and collect data for interpretation. P is also for PBIS, a positive school-wide behavior system that allows our kids to take ownership for their behavior as individuals and as a school community. Q is for query plus questions, which equals inquiry. Garlow is an inquiry-based school. Research tells us that when children make their own discoveries and learning, it sticks. R is for reduce, reuse, and recycle. We reduce, recycle, and reuse and repurpose everything we can. Students not only take ownership for this earth-saving way of living, but it is used to learn math and social studies standards, including measurement, data interpretation, and fundamentals of natural resources. This is for standards. The Minnesota State Academic Standards drive everything that is taught and learned at Garlow. Our Minnesota loons are displayed by student work to highlight which standards are being addressed. For therapy dogs, students can increase their fluency by reading to read certified dogs. Buck, Frankie, and Luna are our three therapy dogs. We are currently on our third round of training even more dogs which has now expanded district-wide. For understanding. Students increase their understanding by tracking their thinking as they read by asking questions, identifying new and learning, recording important information, making connections, and sharing what they find exciting. for vegetables. We grow them ourselves and are a part of a grant called Fresh Fruit and, Fruit and Vegetables program which encourages kids to try new fruits and veggies for healthy school snacks. W is for worm bins in our classrooms. Each class makes their own so the student can so the students can watch the composting process up close. This is a real-life example demonstrating the Minnesota standards of system working together and of living and non-living things. Is for X is for excellence. Carlo is a thrice named National Magnet School of Excellence, 2009, 2010, 2011, and Minnesota Magnet School of Merit. Carla is also twice named number one new and emerging magnet school in the country. Why is for Yum Power, another healthy kids initiative which helps kids track the fruits and vegetables we eat with graphing and charts. Z is for Zantac. We need it with all this hard work. Just kidding. It's fun. We love Garlow.